Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Um, I am sitting in a hotel room in Toronto, Canada, and uh, I'm here for some work, and I uh, figured it would be a good opportunity to talk about some new equipment, specifically tech gear that I have, um, that I travel with, and uh, kind of give you an overview of, of some new stuff, some things that are, I'm a big fan of, um, some things that have sort of changed my carry game. Um, I apologize in advance, I've sort of had to improv improvise my uh, little setup here. I did not bring my tripod, so, I've um, got kind of this funky little stand set up over here, but let's go ahead and talk about my uh, work uh, travel electronic essentials. And specifically, we're gonna get into what I have here in my Evergoods Cap 2. So let's go ahead and dive into it. All right, so we're gonna get to the Cap 2 in a minute um, and, and show you what's inside, but a couple of essentials. I do carry two phones, both are iPhones. This is my work phone and an OtterBox. I've got my um, Evergood, sorry, my uh, Carryology and uh, Bellroy wallet here. Really enjoy that. Uh, Dell laptop for work. I've got some dongles and things like that. Um, you're going to find as we go through this, I'm a big fan of the of Anchor products. So this is the cord that I kind of keep most readily accessible. It's a multi-headed Anchor cord. Um, I've got Lightning USB-C and USB uh, Lightning. Um, so this is kind of like always at the top of my bag, I can quickly grab it. Continuing on, I've got from Anchor the Soundcore over the ear headphones. These are the Life Q20s. I really like these noise canceling headphones. Pretty affordable, they work really well. Nice on a long flight um, or when I'm on a meeting here in the uh, hotel room. So big fan of these Anchor Soundcore, uh, Life, Soundcore Life Q20 over the ear headphones. So with that out of the way, Let's go ahead and talk about my Cap 2. All right, so first of all, um, I've been using a Cap 2 for a while. Um, I also use a Cap 1 Phoenix version. I've used the uh, GoRuck WireDop, WireDop Mini, um, a variety of other tech pouches. This is great, especially given some of the new things I have and just sort of how it organizes. I also like that you know I can use it as the desk caddy when I'm here uh, working uh, from the hotel room. So um, just kind of start on the outside. Um, I do have the Evergoods reflective patch. It's on one of my backpacks, my Evergoods backpack. So I threw the Bounce Design Labs um, sort of uh, night uh, uh, glow in the dark patch on this one. Um, I have a Bounce Design Labs 3DC, which I'll do a video on as well. But that's on the outside. Um, I have business cards here on the outside uh, pockets. I like these for slipping business cards in. I also um, utilize the dot business card for myself. So that's really nice. Um, I do have um, on the top carry handle, this is uh, one of the Night Eyes magnetic carabiners. I use this because the other end is in my GORUCK GRXC1. I can kind of clip it at the top and it keeps it nice and stable up there. It keeps it from falling down in the bag when I don't have it fully loaded out. And a little orange paracord up here in my Ode to Carryology on the top. Um, so that's the outside. Let's go ahead and I'm just gonna open it up and we'll dive right into it. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get into it here. And I'm gonna flip it around like this. Hopefully we can see everything there. There we go. Um, so inside I've got a variety of things. I've changed the carry up a little bit and um, it's it fits perfectly. I, I, I love it, I, it just fits. So I'm gonna kind of go through these things here. So. First off, I have this little Maxpedition pouch in here, or sort of the cords that I don't often use. Um, I have my Seagate one terabyte hard drive. I have the charger for my Garmin watch, the, the cord for the Seagate, and actually the um, cord for my Anchor uh, sound core over the ear headphones in case I need to plug into my laptop if I'm not using the Bluetooth function. So um, these kind of sit in this little pouch and it sits nicely in here, okay? Um, so kind of continuing on, I'm gonna to get to some of this stuff here in a second, um, but I just do have a, a USB-C to lightning, and that's just sort of rolled up and placed in this front pocket here. Um, also just sort of placed in there, I have this Anchor multi-port um, uh, seven in one USB-C media hub. So um, I like this because I can do SD, micro SD, HDMI, um, all sorts of stuff. So that sort of just kind of hangs out in here, um, thusly. <clears throat> and then um, 
Inside the zipper compartment here, I have some sort of, um, I have some backup cards, some cash, my American Airlines Admirals Club card, just a few little backup things. Um, and then I also do have an Apple AirTag sitting in there. Okay, so next up, this is just a Logitech mouse. I like how thin this is, um, really nice. Um, doesn't take up a lot of space. It's actually very comfortable and easy to use. So um, just a really good mouse, slides in there nicely. doesn't take up hardly any room, um, very easy to use. So, okay, so the next two things are my newest um, additions to my tech kit. So I'm gonna pull them out and we'll talk about them. So, okay, so I just picked these up. Um, you may have noticed in the previous shot that uh, my laptop is connected to the Dell charging brick. Um, the reason that is, is I, this is my first time with this, and so I wanted to make sure that it was gonna work well, um, and so I did bring my Dell um, power cord as a backup. But the plan going forward is, you've got this Anchor GAN Prime. Um, this will charge my laptop. So this USB-C to USB-C plus this will charge my laptop. Um, it's a three-in-one, so I can charge my laptop from the USB-C. I can do another USB-C to Lightning for like my tablet, my phones, and then I do have the USB-A, uh, so I can use that multi-charger here. So um, I have used it on my laptop, it does work fine. Again, first trip, I was just trying to make sure it was everything was good. Um, I've got this Anchor braided USB-C to USB-C. So the nice thing and the reason I got this is because you know, this takes the place of that giant brick, which just doesn't fit well into this or really anything else. So I would often find myself carrying that brick in a separate pouch or something like that. So this is a real game changer for me because it's uh, just of its form factor. So really a big fan of this. Um, I would highly recommend Anchor products. As you can tell, I have a lot of them. So this charging solution now, cord goes back in here doesn't take up a lot of space. And then that charging brick can just slide down in there. My Maxpedition pouch goes in. I have my seven in one here, charger, or the uh, lightning, and I'm good to go. Um, up in the top here, a couple of things. Sharpie, uh, this is a paper mate uh, pen, mechanical pencil. I have just another pen. This one actually has a stylus on it. And then, um, I will often clip my keys with my dongle, which was attached to my laptop in here. But so, for example, there's another little dongle that usually sits like that. And then I recently picked this up. I'm, I'm really enjoying it. This is um, from Zebra. This is their mechanic or their uh, their EDC pen. Really enjoying this. Nice weight, form factor, writes really well. Have paper soaks up the ink. So. Um, this has become my sort of primary writing implement, so i uh, big fan of this. So those are all sitting there, and that's really it. That's the, that's the tech kit. Um, the biggest game changer has been this GNA Prime um, wall adapter. I mean, it's just great. I would definitely recommend that you take a look at what your laptop needs for charging purposes and make sure you get the correct one. I think this is the 100 watt I'm not mistaken. Um, yeah, this is the 100 watt one. So make sure you get the right wattage to support your device. Um, but I'm, I've been very happy with it. So, you know, that's the tech kit. Um, and it's, I mean, I, I don't think you could have designed it better for the cap too. I mean, everything just fits perfectly in there. So um, enjoying it. Hope, uh, hope you find this video useful. Um, I'll be getting into a video on my Balance Design Labs 3DC here shortly, but that's my tech kit. That's what I carry with when I travel. So hope you enjoyed the video. We'll catch you next time.